This amazing little uh, grotto volcano doesn't stop to amaze us. Yesterday we had a rupture of the north wall and the lava poured out around the uh, north area. It, it didn't reach before that much other than the other winds. At the same time, we had added bonus of a tornado or we should call it dust devil. And today we have this, a beautiful lava Whirl or lava tornado, we should call it, or fire wheel, we should call it. All the names, pick your own choice. And as you can see, it's coming through the lava as if air is spattering, pushing the lava out with lots of force. This area had a lot of, you know, uh, little uh, valleys and little uh, canals dug by the previous fall, uh, flows of the lava, as you can see here. Uh, is already flowing in that area. The moment you think it's finished, it comes back, of course, this uh, lava whirl. And now it's finished. You think it's finished? Now it's coming back. <laughs> Bigger. It's building up its energy as if. Anyway, along this lava flows, we have a lot of air pockets trapped. And when the lava comes back, some of them get trapped in the impasse. That is a dead end. And what happens is that the air pushes out as the lava pulls. Uh, into the cavity and yet yeah, the air bursts and what you see is this lava wheeled or uh, uh, whirlwind or dust devil or tornado whatever you call it tornado is a more easier term people understand it better you can see here uh, this is a more close-up view of that as you can see it's turning and scattering lava around it and this lava is really fine. Some of it may be even the uh, pellets hair, those very thin uh, glass uh, strings. And this is the, along that canal is formed, along that pathway that the lava had, the little canyon it built there. And is, I will reverse it actually, but let me just reverse it after this. Let's just finish, watch that. Beautiful. <laughs> oh, it cannot be, it's like a, Little baby making bubbles. Some, sometimes it looks like that. I mean, no, who has not made it? When you were a kid, you have made it also. Anyway, I'm going now to reverse this and just see how it is. It's going forward fast, then I will come back. That makes it easier for us to see. Reversing it now. You can see that the, uh, the lava whirlwind is limited to the pathway of the flow of the lava. <laughs> it's going back again. Okay, I have a video about it. And that was made when we had the dust devil in the eruption site. Right? We have seen the whirlwind or dust devil forming near the lava river, which is now coming from the other side of the uh, Little Hotro volcano. We had a collapse of the volcano's walls and uh, the extensive amount of the lava which is flowing now toward the actually old canyon is is amazing it creates a lot of heat and that heat creates dust devil or whirlwind as you can see here and it flows in front of us actually <laughs> people are just there they just turned back and saw it passing almost gone i returned it back so we can actually see it again oh yeah, it's going, oh, it's coming back. <laughs> Please, somebody stop this. I want to talk about the, how those tables are made. <laughs> but anyway, oh, it's coming back. <laughs> that's, that's really funny, those tables. Anyway, it needs a fair well, uh, fair weather. It needs a, a lot of heat, of course, temperate. In temperate and tropical regions, it forms easier. It needs also that uh, heat rise without being sheared, without being cut. The difference between the tornado is that tornado uh, is in a storm. Dust devil is in just a fair weather. So it just quickly forms and then disappears after a while. Uh, it's quite small also.